Okay. guys welcome back to my channel I am doing a beautifully short little video today with a product that I have been waiting for for quite some time now it is Patrick Ta's new major brow so if you've ever watched my channel before or you can just tell by looking at me I've got some caterpillars I mean I'm not Groucho Marx but I could be if I let them go it is a challenge unlike any other to keep these guys in place I have the thinnest hair on my head possible and the thickest eyebrows on the planet thank you God for that gift at any rate I am always trying to get these unruly guys to stay in place and so I am so excited because this product is marketed as literally giving you a laminated eyebrow I have not tried these on, I have not used them, I have just researched them extensively so I know how to use it just right, and I am going to try them for the first time on camera with you. So I'm going to shut up now so we can do it. Let's open up this little ditty. So actually, Patrick Ta's Major Brow comes in two shades. You can get a tinted shade or you can get a clear shade. I happen to get the tinted one because, you know, they're dark. So the tinted one looks like this, but I believe this is fairly sheer. I also went ahead and got the dual ended brow brush and isn't it stunning? The angled tip, I think that's phenomenal. And then on the other side is a very generous size spoolie, which heaven knows I need. So on his tutorials, he has his brow brush, uh, the spoolie slanted. So I'm just gonna do that. I didn't break it. So Patrick Ta himself and actually the directions on the back say you need to activate this formula before you can use it, which is so intriguing to me. He suggests water or like a fix plus or like setting spray type mist, which is exactly what I'm gonna use. I'm gonna follow his directions to the T. So what he does is he sprays a little bit inside the pan and then uses his spoolie. Let's do that. So I'm going to do exactly what he tells me to do. So here you can actually kind of see the amount of product that comes on it. It's, it's a more sheer. Let's give this a go. Whoa. Perhaps I should have trimmed them too. Holy cow. I mean, it like lifted my eye. Looky here, ladies, if you are looking for an eye lift, look no further than this eyebrow wax. It literally lifted my eye. That's insane. Okay, I'm gonna do a second coat for a good measure. That is like the softest, most feathery brow ever. Holy stinking cow. I'm only going to do one eye because I wanna be able to see the difference. I can already see the difference. I think you could probably too when you watched this. But there is one more step to sort of like laminate the whole brow. Part of that entails leaving this to sit exactly how you want it for two to three minutes. So I'm going to sit here and I am going to wait the full three minutes. I'll be back. So after waiting the full three minutes, I looked online and realized you only need to wait one to two minutes. <laughs> so the next step to laminate your brows would be to press them in an upward motion to kind of set them in place. He is obviously using his brush uh, when he demonstrates that, so that's what I'm going to do. So he took the brush and literally went like this with it. Oh my gosh, yes. I mean, so as you can see, I have really long eyebrows. Yes, I do trim them. This is how fast they grow. All right, so the lamination process on this side is complete, 
and you can kind of see the difference on my eye. I mean, this one looks so much more lifted and fluffy and alive and natural, and this one looks dragging me down and ugly and weird. So obviously this is a phenomenal product. So there's a couple things that I will note. He recommends that if you have a eyebrow pencil, you fill it in first if you're choosing to use one. You fill it in before you're using the wax. If you use a powder or a pomade or those types of products, then you put it in after you've done the wax. So the eyebrow wax is $22. I believe on Sephora right now it's actually sold out, but you can get on the email list to let you know when it's back in stock. Um, I haven't checked the actual Patrick Ta website, which is where I bought mine from, but usually there's more stock there than there is on Sephora. The uh, eyebrow brush is $18, and I mean, it is an eyebrow brush, but it's a stinking beautiful eyebrow brush, so. Now that I have told you those things, I'm gonna give this a second time around just to make sure, and I'm gonna do this eyebrow so that they're evened out. Okay, I am done. As you can see by the end there, I feel like maybe this eyebrow is a little bit thinner, and so that one looked a little scary at the end there. However, um, what I have noticed, and this might be because I have really ridiculously thick eyebrows that are long, um, they do tend to flatten out, so the, the lamination part, I mean on this side, it's already fallen a little bit, it's not like those wispies that were coming up before, but it still is combed up in that general direction and is so far better than any other eyebrow product I have used thus far. And even though this is just a first impressions and I've only used this one time, I have a feeling this is going to be my new go-to. I stink and love it. It really holds them in place. Um, so I feel like it might be applying as much or as little as what works for you or what type of eyebrow that you have, but I truly love the tinted look. Um, if you have dark eyebrows like me, you can go for the tinted, it's not scary. Is it a little bit like a soap brow? Yes, it is. They both do the same thing, but I'm here to tell you as somebody with really crazy eyebrows and who has done the soap brow method a million times, this worked 10,000 times better than doing the soap brow, and I do soap brows from time to time. In my opinion, they are different. Okay, that's all I've got for you guys today. Thank you so much for sticking around. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I would super appreciate that. And hit the like button so I know that you liked it and that you like new product reviews. And for sure, for sure, for sure, hit the notification bell so you can be reminded when I drop one of these super really random videos that I didn't notify anybody about. That's all I got. Thanks so much for sticking around. And hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye.